All new at six, some great news for teachers working in DeKalb County. This week, the county school board approved $41 million in incentive bonuses to be handed out starting the semester. Yeah, that's really cool. So the goal is to retain as many teachers as possible. That's something we're seeing across the country, that it's uh, really a challenge. 11 Alive's Bo Beth Yates has all the details on how much money the teachers will actually be receiving. Bo Beth? Well, while this may not solve all the problems that cab employees have, many say being paid a little more will certainly ease some of the burden. And those incentives go anywhere from $250 to $4,000. And the cab is looking to retain and attract personnel from bus drivers, cafeteria workers, custodians, teachers, paraprofessionals, principals, etc. For Dahlia Turner with the Georgia Federation of Teachers is referring to the $41 million incentive bonuses approved during Monday's DeKalb School Board meeting. You have heard Dr. Ward Smith talk about the number of hires that have happened over the past few months, but the increasing numbers of resignations. So we are hopeful that this next agenda item will help us to stop the bleed in some form. We want our employees to know that they're valued. We want our employees to know that we want them to stay with us. The board approved three separate bonuses. The first would be distributed in February, given $1,000 to everyone hired before October 1st, 2022. The payment drops to 500 for those hired after and 250 for subs. The second incentive is a $500 payment to be issued in May for those who missed less than two days of work during the spring semester. And Deborah Jones, the president of the organization of DeKalb educators says the third retention incentive ranges from $2,000 to $4,000 and it's for teachers who relocate to schools in areas many are reluctant to go. To people who would move from areas one, two, three, and four over to five, six, and seven and that's because in those areas they don't have the teacher, the manpower that they need to teach our children. That incentive does require a two-year commitment, and Turner says rewarding school employees for their hard work is a step in the right direction. As due personnel has earned it. Now, one of the largest incentives being offered is $4,000. That's for math, science, and new special ed teachers. Live in DeKalb County, Bo Beth Yates, 11 Alive News.